Well, this morning, Trooper Brian North's defense will start to lay out its case. North is charged with manslaughter in the shooting death of Mubarak Suleiman back in 2020. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Olivia Schuler joins us now live in Milford with more on what's expected to happen in the courtroom today. Good morning, Olivia. Roger, good morning. Well, the defense claims that North believed that he and his fellow officers were being threatened, and that's why he fired his gun. Now, today, North's defense team will di dig deeper into giving those details on why they believe that North is innocent of that manslaughter charge. Now, on Thursday, the prosecution finished laying out its case against Brian North. Evidence and witness testimony spanned over four days. On day four, a state trooper took to the stand. Ross Dolling was the third trooper involved in the pursuit the night that North shot and killed Mubar Mubarak Solomon after the high-speed chase from Norwalk to West Haven. Dolling says everything happened so fast there was no time to de-escalate escalate the situation. Jurors also heard from a state police sergeant who responded to the scene. A video and forensic examiner slowed down a body-worn camera, and the final witness was the medical examiner who performed the autopsy. She says that three of the four bullets to the chest alone would have been deadly. Solomon was shot seven times. Now, on our website, you can find a full article that gives details about the trial thus far. Once again, we'll be back in the courtroom starting at 10 o'clock this morning as the defense starts their case. We're live this morning in Milford, Olivia Schuler, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.